What's up guys, it's Jazz, and welcome to the new season of the studio world here. I just loaded up a new seed. I haven't really explored it yet. I actually just loaded this inside to record. So, I'm gonna try to do this more how I see skins. Oh my god, it's a fox! The fox is killing the chicken. I'm so glad I was recording that. What just happened? Um, okay. Well... We go check that out. Is he going after another chicken? Oh, he's playing in the water! Oh my goodness! He actually did kill the chicken. Well, I guess. I don't want to scare him away. But, like. Thanks for the food, Bub. Bud, thanks. What are you. Here, do you want. But yeah, uh, this is gonna be episode one. We're gonna kind of figure out what's going on get us what the what what this is a bad idea but yeah so I should get some basic tools before I go down this hole but that looks eerily promising um plant that flower there but yeah so I'm gonna get started I'm gonna gather up some materials and then we'll get ready to go down that weird looking hole there and figure out what we had. I think I already saw some iron. This might be the best start to a Minecraft world I've ever had. So, let's get going. I'll be back with you guys in three, two, one. Alrighty guys, it looks like we are ready to go here. I've got all my stuff for us to go explore that hole over there. And yes, I built an awkward little dirt tile thing there. I've done a little bit of resource gathering, not a whole lot. Got a little wheat farm started. There's also a really cool system I want to explore over there, but I kind of want to get some iron first and make me uh, a shield because there is a skeleton over there and I've already been attacked by two little kids and I almost died. So, not, not a fan on that space yet. So we're just gonna make our way down here ever so carefully. So now we're gonna make us, we're gonna smelt up the iron and get this going here. I had oak plates with me, I could have made more torches while I was down there. Oh, I think I'm actually blind sometimes. Exploring and see if we can find some villages that might have some carrots and potatoes in them. First off, I need to write down these coordinates because y'all know I'm directionally challenged and I will not find my way back. So, worst case scenario, if we cannot find any cows, we do have some pintos over here. Um, I don't plan on killing these. But, if we don't find some cows, we've got some pentos. Also, I started exploring and totally forgot to go back and like grab all the iron stuff, so like, I'm screwed if I die. I was actually just getting food.
swamp are so gross looking. Oh, hi, Creeper and Skelly. Nope. 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 We're noping right out of there. Creepers, they don't scare me as much. There's a lot of skeletons down here, actually. I'm just gonna nope. Oh, hey, I'm here. expedition without dying. Okay guys, so we made it back after our exploration. Didn't die, don't know how. Um, so far, really didn't take many risks. Didn't find anything but a bunch of cows, so we have plenty of leather now to actually make all the books. So you'll see if I can look properly. Over here we've got a bunch of sugar cane growing. And our wheat farm's expanded, and we've got some now cocoa beans, and you can see I made it back. We got all kitted out with some iron armor, and yeah, we're just waiting for everything to cook. And then, I don't know what we'll do next. We might go exploring the other direction, which would be that away. Yeah, because I came from that away, so I believe if we go that away. We might find some other cool stuff and hopefully a village at some point but yeah so i'm gonna leave it here for now i'll come back in another clip i don't know how long it'll take me to film it but we'll be back so i decided i'm gonna go explore and see if i can find a village and i realized the last time we went on the other side of this mountain here so i just looped my way around it and um yeah we went the wrong way around that earlier that is interesting um, what? Oh wow, lots of gravel over here. Lots of... Did we go this way and I just not notice? Is this two separate villages or is this one village separated by... A, um... River. Oh, dope. Hi, have we met the wizard of the north yet? somebody in here. Nope, nobody? Really? Okay. Now my luck, all of our villagers here have wandered into that lava falling over there. It's a really pretty village house. Like, I didn't really explore the villages or play a whole lot in 114, so like, I haven't really played a whole lot in Minecraft. And, like taken advantage of the new features since like 1.12. So there's a lot of things that, like I've seen in videos and I'm like, oh yeah, that's super cool. That house stretches over the ravine. Also, hi, there's another ravine. No, no, go in the hole. No. Really? I'm trying to try and make y'all safe. It makes you become a tool. Are you nudging me? Because I tried to nudge you into the hole. Oh, hey, there he is. Zoho Blacksmith, I appreciate you. Um, 
we did it. We're in the nether now. And honestly, we got kind of a not great nether spawn. I can already hear gas. Jesus. I might take that back. There's another beginning of another fortress right there. However, the reason I say that is um, we may as well be playing Skyblock. Because how we're going to get there, I have no bleeding idea. Um, I really wish I could put this down there. And honestly, I think I'm going to, except for I did not bring a diamond pickaxe. Yeah, how we're gonna get down there. So, I guess we could guesstimate the distance and then try to move our portal eight times that much in the overworld. Uh, maybe? That's how that works, right? I hear a ghast. You know what? We're just gonna- Nope. I need to yeet myself on out of here. That's what I get for breaking that portal. Well, bye. I got all my stuff back. I love the random bamboo, it makes such a great little landmark. <laughs> 